Yo, what is good, YouTube? Krishan checking back in with another video. The 2024 Toronto Pro has concluded, and Akeem Williams is our winner. Akeem is headed back to the Mr. Olympia. In second place, we had a very good version of Quentin Araya, Quint Beastwood. Third place, John Jewett. Incredible showing, and looking at this show at prejudging, I would not have been upset if John actually took second. And in fourth place, we had Robin Strand. Fifth place was Tim Budisheim. Congratulations to all of these guys, but the biggest congratulations, of course, goes out to the champ, Akeem Williams. We will be seeing him in just a few months at the Mr. Olympia. And let's take a closer look at the top four from prejudging because I did not get a chance to make a prejudging video. The times listed for prejudging and finals were significantly off for this show. Also, the backdrop was very distracting and do not get me started on the $60 price for the show. But outside of that, this was a pretty good show. Now, focusing on the top four, to me personally, when Akeem Williams came out, I did see him as the clear winner. Even going into this show, we knew that Akeem was going to bring something different. In second place was Quentin Araya. Quinn was up at least 10 pounds from the New York Pro. I definitely think this was a better look for him. But unfortunately, due to Quinn being so tall, he still needs to add more size. I said that he was up at least 10 pounds from New York, and to me personally, some of that 10 pounds was body fat, but nevertheless, a great look from Quint. And as you guys can see, he doesn't do all the shaking with his posing anymore. Now, third place, John Jewett. Incredible look, and John actually stacked up size-wise a lot better than I was expecting. Why did John place in third? I think he lost a lot of ground from behind, and John was at least 230 at this show, moving up from 212. I think a lot of that weight is noticeable in the midsection. Not saying that he has a bubble gut, but definitely has to keep it controlled at all times. And I know that John Jewett also did the Legion Sports Fest and Open, and this isn't his first open show, but I did want to mention that he moved up from 212 and has already put on 20 pounds of muscle. Now in fourth place, we had a very good version of Robin Strand. A lot of people may not have had Robin on their radar, but I did have Robin fourth or fifth in my predictions. He looked great at this show, brought incredible conditioning, he has the size. Robin just doesn't have the structure and the shape of the guys that placed ahead of him, especially like Akeem and Quint. But looking at Robin from the front, he has some great quads, also brought pretty good conditioning. He just needs more volume in the upper body, especially throughout the chest, the delts, and the arms. And last but not least, I did want to talk about Hassan Mustafa, who was unable to finish top five at this show. Now going into the Toronto Pro, pretty much all of us knew that Hassan was not going to be ready. I even heard a rumor that his coach, Dorian Hamilton, wanted to pull him out of this show because he was not going to be ready in time. But Hassan actually looked pretty good at this show outside of his conditioning, which is actually a good thing. If Hassan just continues to dive for a couple more weeks, hops into the Vancouver Pro, maybe a Chicago Pro in a couple weeks, I'm pretty sure he will be a lot better. But as far as this Toronto Pro first show with Dorian Hamilton, was not a good look. But that's going to wrap up the video, guys. Sorry, it is a little bit short. I did not expect the show to run this late, but tomorrow we will take a closer look at the competitors. But just to recap, Akeem Williams did win the 2024 Toronto Pro, Quentin Araya in second place, third place John Jewett, fourth place Robin Strand, and fifth place Tim Budisheim. I hope you guys did indeed enjoy this video, and if you have not done so already, be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. I'm Christian from Go Fitness, and that's it. I'm out.